Hola, my name is Pedro Salai. I'm thrilled to be the guest choreographer of Charlottesville Ballet. I'm a native from Venezuela, that's in South America, but my both parents, they're Hungarian. And I have a training in the National Ballet of Caracas for many years. And I came to the United States uh, to New York Dance Theater Company in New York. And I was uh, coached by Madame Darvash. And after that, they took me to Richmond Ballet, who I danced for many, many, many years. And now I am the artistic director of a ballet company in the Southwest. Virginia called Southwest Virginia Ballet already for eight years. And I have my own uh, school program in the public schools called Dance Español. I teach Spanish through dance in the public schools. The inspiration of this piece is so important, especially because it's about the music. Without music, we are not able to create, especially as a choreography, this beautiful piece. And it's so important for me to use something from my, my roots from South America. I know I have the roots from the Hungarian, but this composer uh, is a 20th century composer. And uh, he used the, the roots of his native from Brazil, but he has a little bit classical influence. They're comparing him with Sebastian Bach. And that's why I choose the Bacchianas Brasileiras, and I use the number two because there are nine pieces of the Bacchianas. So I'm using the number two in this, there are four sections. The music is so intricate in every section and very meaningful because it's, you feel the, the growth of the piece with the music together and the, the influence that's very, very important. So I'm working together with Cecile Tutsi, former dancer from Richmond Valley, creating this lovely costume, very colorful because that's, you know, Brazil and South America, Venezuela, all these countries, we are very colorful and that's how we we are alive, so you will enjoy the costumes and the color and the movement. The, the creative part, you know, as a choreographer, I like to hear the music and see the dancers, how much they can develop, you know, not only technically, you know, emotionally too, because that's very important to work together because we are, it's like a painting, you know, we have the idea, we have the, the oil, or we have the pastel, it's the same thing as dancers. I have the tools to give me, but sometimes the dancers create their own movement and they like their own movement, the, the arms, the legs, and the musicality. So we develop the piece together. It's not only my piece. Without them, I will not be able to create my piece for you guys for the, for the performance. It's, it's a work together. It's a, you know, work together to make this idea, a crazy idea of my head, to, um, to make it visible for the audience. I'm so excited and thrilled to be present this piece on the main stage performance on October 11 at 2 o'clock at the Piedmont Virginia Community College. Hope to see you there at the theater.